Hello, and welcome back for our playthrough of Nino Kuni 2. I was just going to grind, but apparently, I cannot continue the story anymore unless I talk to these guys. Uh, sorry, I can't grind unless I talk to these guys first. So this may be a really weird video where I only do like one or two minutes of actually story, and then, you know, 14 minutes of grinding, but because I, I thought I could just watch, if I try to just run out, because usually it's like, listen to the report, but you can go do stuff. Nope. I can't. So at this point, I seem to be locked in. So I'm going to go ahead and listen to this. Hmm. One one really has returned we encountered the creature in the skies above the blackened isle. Or did it on a memolith? You need to see this. It appeared along with a large landmass, which we can only assume to be the continent that was lost when the Horned One was sealed away. Hmm. Enormous. Huh? Look, it's, it's Longfang. Not just Longfang, lad. Old blessed lot in there, Brian Skimmer, Bastion, and Oakenheart, too. The variable Kingmaker's Conference. There is something different in their being. These are not true Kingmakers. These are facsimiles, created through the power of the stolen King's Bond, I would assume. Whatever they are, they created some kind of barrier to protect the Horned One. Indeed, in the moment the barrier was raised, the field began absorbing a succession of spheres of pure light. What the? of well, what could they be give me just a moment Roland at moments after observing the first of these spheres the horned one began to expel a great cloud of black creatures yeah, and they went flying off in every direction likely not too many of them headed this way enough they look horrible oh erg sorry no now, as to the natures of the fears of light, it is my belief that they were souls, distillations of the very essence of life. The Horned One is absorbing the souls of the people of the world and transforming them, enslaving them. Oh my! That's awful. That's bad. Remember what Deloran did to Vermi when the life was leached from him? He became a little more than a walking corpse. What happens when a person's soul is stolen? You're saying that's happening to people all over the world, even as we speak, they're being turned into the living dead. How can we turn them back? Well... I cannot say for certain, but there must surely be a way. Mm -hmm. How come there's none around these parts have had their souls t taken hostage? Hmm. I think we may have Lofty to thank for that. No, man! I ain't done nothing have to, which is the one thing our nation has that the others don't anymore. That's right, a kingmaker. The bond between you and Evan is still strong, that means we're protected. Yeah! Not bad, Mr. Kingmaker, not bad. Mm-hmm, in it though. Reckon I had a little inkling, it might be something like that, stands to reason, me being all important. Mm. Why has he done all this? Why would he be so depressed? Desperate to bring back the Horned One in the first place. Hmm. Believe I can help you there. Huh. <gasps> Majesty. Must forgive the intrusion, Evan. Circumstances being what they are. Not at all. You're very welcome. No. Now, on the subject of who Deloren is and what exactly he might want, I believe I have some information that may clarify things a little further. Two thousand years ago, he was the ruler of a nation known as Allegoria, and he made a pact with the Horned One. Though he was, was a small and insignificant kingdom, by listening to the aid of such a kingmaker, he thought to make Allegoria great, to bend the singular evil to his will. Hmm. How is with what Nial told us, back when we first learned about Deloren? Things did not go according to plan. Instead, a terrible tragedy befell the realm. Far from growing great, it disappeared from the world entirely. Believed that he was unable to contain the fiend's all-consuming corruption, and that the entire continent Allegoria stood upon was spirited away to a place between worlds. 
Hmm. Whatever happened, the Lauren would appear to be determined to revive this vanished land. What? Why? Why would he want to bring back bring it back after all these years? I don't know, but I think you understand why he needed all those king's bonds now. Without them, he couldn't hope to control something so powerful. But whether we're an inkling or why not, I say this yeah, da, 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 we're gonna kick his butt. If DeLorean's got what he wanted, why would he be stealing everyone's souls? Each follower, subjects, the more powerful he grows, the more powerful his kingmaker grows in turn. One whose ambition stretches far as enlisting the aid of such an entirely evil being will surely not be satisfied with merely recovering his lost realm. Nope, now that he has the means at his command, it would seem he intends to bring all the peoples of the world under his dark dominion. Wants to take over the whole world, or we can't let him, we won't. Yeah. How exactly are we supposed to stop him? You th saw the size of that mountain of spikes he calls the Kingmaker, didn't you? Mm. There is one possibility. Mornstar, the sword said to have sealed away the horned one evil all those centuries ago. Mornstar? Alas, its whereabouts are no longer known. There is yet time, the great evil gathers its forces still. Or to be found before it reaches its full strength, we may yet stand a chance. How do we find if nobody knows where it is? Now, indeed, any tale two millennia in the making will almost certainly be more fantasy than fact by now. And surely no records from the time remain. A thousand years. <laughs> you might know just where to find records from that far back, don't you, Evan? Oh. Of course, the Librarian Code Power. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You're right, if anything from back then did survive, you bet Bodley will know about it. Seems we have a plan of action, we will inform the rulers of the realms of all that has come to pass, rally them to the cause, and make ready to take the Horned One by force, we will seek out further clues as to Mornstar's whereabouts. Alright. Very well, until we meet again. About exposition dump. Alright. Let's see now. All right, now we can grind. Now, oh good. Block. Die. Stop P. Ever Lady Trudy. All right, Ding Dong Dell signed up. Cool. I assume. I can do side questing now, so let me quickly save. All right, and you're gonna, unfortunately, you're gonna be stuck for like, with side questing for the last, I'll say, 10 minutes of this video. So if you wanna skip ahead to the next one, if it's available, I completely understand. That is all I'm going to do is side questing. So. Just keep that in mind. Manage the kingdom. Wow. The stores. 999. We've maxed out how much stuff. Right, I need to get up to level four. Right. Uh, doing research. Where was I doing research? Ah! Here. Well. Level up. Kimmy. Button. There we go. Gotta remember how to do that. Yeah. Search. I mean, I get... Oh, no. Go ahead. Cue that one up. Oh, we are doing research here. Oh, can't do that one. Can't do that one. Can't do that one. So all these personnel, 
I've got to find other things to do. Um, any research here? Two people know Creative Flare. I only have one. All these people will keep Fi uh, Master Fido. Everyone else. Find other stuff to do. Like I said, the rest of this episode is going to be pretty boring. So if you want to shuffle around to other videos, you know, I can. Um, there. Don't have any more deep dedication. Can't do any more there. I'm waiting on there. I mean, I could. Can I do the Hubbly Bubblery? Edge Magic. Master of Cauldrons. Oh, we may have it. So let's go level up some personnel. Citizens, if you will. Bracken. Hey! Wow. <laughs> Alright, sort name. Alright, so. Yeah. Master of Cauldron Sense. That's good. Master of Sorcerer's Instinct. Hey good. Anyone else? Really? That's it? Ah, and eight. Andy. <laughs> Master of Fluency in Hig. I think that is everyone. So we'll throw a bunch of personnel in here. Yeah, let's go ahead. I'm gonna lose items, but that's okay. Two of them in cauldron sets. That's fine. And if we go to research, we can do hyper stimulation. That up. I did clear out the old hubbly bubbly, right? Yeah, got it all. All right. No. Can't research anything there or there because I need to find the right people. Can't research anything there or there because I need to find the right people. I've got six people. Throw someone in here. Huh? After that... I use a second person. You should really be able to search by unassigned. We've got three, we've got three, three, three. Second person. Fine. We're actually doing fine with mining equipment. Go ahead and throw a third person in here. Person in here. Oh, go. Third person in here. I 
That's everyone? That's everyone. Alright, so we are good. About 62 of a possible 64. Happy the coffers. Say. So at this point, we have unlimited KG. Empty the stores, and now it's just side questing. So it's been 15 minutes. That is a short enough video. So I hope you're enjoying the series. Uh, feel free to leave a like, subscribe, or comment. Or come on over and check me out on Twitch when I stream live. Thank you very much for watching. Have a nice day.